Hey, what's up YouTube? Back with your boy Luke. Hey guys, check this out. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the famous red light district in Tijuana, Mexico, also known as Zona Norte. And I'm going to give you guys a rundown of the bars and the girls and the restaurants and the action over the holidays, okay? As we move into Thanksgiving, December, and January, some things are going to change and I'm going to let you guys know about those changes. Before we get started, if you're new here, go ahead and smash that red like and subscribe button at the bottom of the screen. Hit the thumbs up and hit that notification bell. My name is Luke. I do videos about Mexico. Most of my videos are about Tijuana, Mexico, and specifically Zona Norte, the famous red light district. Okay, guys? We also talk about bars, beaches, girls, Bogota, Colombia, Panama, a lot of other things too. All right, guys, let's just jump right into it. First of all, the bars are going to be pretty much wide open all through the month of November. Thanksgiving is not really celebrated that much in a lot of parts of Mexico. It is celebrated more toward the border areas as opposed to down in South Mexico, but you can fully expect these bars to be open on Thanksgiving Day and throughout the month of November. So if you're thinking about going in November, it's going to be wide open, it's going to be on and cracking, you're going to have a great time. Now guys, as you get into December, all the bars are going to be open, okay? Even on Christmas Day, the HK, the Adelita Bar, the Chicago Club, those bars will be open. They're open 365, 24-7. However, what you're going to find is a lot of the girls, and I mean a lot of the girls, are going to start disappearing around December 15th. They're going to start flying back home to South Mexico, Mexico City, Monterey, wherever they live. They're going to be going home for the Christmas holidays, okay? Most of these girls are going to spend the Christmas holidays and the New Year's holidays at home, okay? And you won't see them reappearing until about January 15th, even maybe even February the 1st, okay? So what I'm saying is a lot of the girls are going to be out of town from December 15th to January 15th. Now the bars are still going to be open. The bars are still going to have girls there. There's just not going to be as many people. I mean, think about it, really. How many people, both workers and customers, are really going to be at a bar in Zona Norte, Tijuana's Red Light District on Christmas Day? Well, I will be, that's for sure. I'll see you December 25th. I'll be down there. But what I'm saying is a lot of these girls are going to be home with their families, okay? Now, guys, if you're planning a trip for November, December, January to go to Zona Norte, maybe you have time off of work or you're planning it with your buddies, it's absolutely going to be a fun time to go, okay? This is not to say you can't have a good time in January, in December. You absolutely can, okay? There's just going to be more people there more stuff to do and more stuff going on during the other months of the year. Simply because the majority of the girls will be back home for the Christmas and New Year's holidays. But guys, like I said, if you're thinking about going, go ahead and go. You're going to have a great time. All right, guys, if you hadn't done it already, one more time. Smash that like and subscribe button. Keeping these videos short. Getting straight to the point. Any questions you have about Tijuana, Mexico, living in Mexico, Zona Norte, the famous red light district, hit me up. My name is Luke. I'm here to help you guys. Until next time, we'll see you down the road.